Okay, uh... Okay, there we go. Um, it's displaying the right game now. <clears throat> okay. Now, let's copy and paste this to a bunch of sites. Okay. Here's the most boring part where I just post where I just shell this on a bunch of sites. And we're just gonna have to wait until I I I mean on a bunch of Discord servers. Shut up shut up, Cedric. Okay. Gonna put it there. Ooh. Thank God none of you can see that. All right. Um, Put it there. <clears throat> All right. Put it here. And, okay, uh, I shelled it on enough places. Uh, let's, ooh, let's, uh, start the game. Hey, let's start the game. It's a Pepsi Man man would say. Are you enjoying the flight on Pelican Sam Airlines, Freddy? A lot. Sam. Gosh, Luther, it was really great of your Uncle Blenny to invite us to the Founders Day Festival. Well, Uncle Blenny says that I'm his favorite nephew. And you know I'd never take a special trip like this without my best friend, Freddy Fish. Are you fucking shit? Thanks for the lift, Sam. Have a good time. Okay. Um. There will be visitors from around the world at the Founders Day Festival. That foreign language phrase book could really <coughs> come in handy. Right as rain, Freddy. It's all yours. As soon as you give me one R and C or Janetti. Oh boy. Oh man, Orin Jesus has a treat for us today. Um. Wow! So many clickable things. <laughs> so many clickable things and whatever. Visiting new places is really exciting. You're really gonna love the festival, Freddy. It's the greatest, just like you. Aw. That's really nice. Now, I'm going to be doing this sober, because, like, you know, apparently... 
Yeah, you know, to be fair, like, you know, it wasn't that interesting while I was drunk. I feel like I probably would have, like, you know, shared details about my life anyway. Well, I mean, barely any details about my life anyways. So, you know, drunk or not. Wow. It's not really anything too personal. Sorry, I'm adjusting the mic. Okay. That old fishing net is blocking our path. I wonder how we can get past it. Yeah, I wonder. But first, click a jigs. Wow! So cool. Anyways, this is this is the easiest puzzle ever. Hmm. I wonder what will happen if I pull this plug. How Great did they job. set that up? I knew anyways. you could pull it up. Get it? Pull up? Oh, Luther. Luther, that was a that was a really shitty ass joke. You should be ashamed of yourself, Luther. God. Anyways, uh, have to collect that. Why don't they set this I up anyways? Hold on to this. You just never know when a drain plug might come in handy. Maybe if the mouse was over here, it would be good, yeah. The mouse is pretty good here. Alright. Luther! Freddy! Over here! Uncle Blanny? Oh no. Uncle Blanny, what are you doing in jail? <laughs> well, Luther, the great conch shell was stolen. The Founder's Day Festival can't start without it. Since I'm the grand exalted keeper of the conch, I'm the prime suspect. But I didn't do it. Here, here's a diagram of the conch shell before it was taken. The priceless conch had three golden pipes, but they may have fallen out. And here's a picture of all the people who were nearby when the crime happened. There's Gil Barker, Claw, Nadine the Narwhal, Rosie Pearl, Pierre the Tailor, and Horst Fetters the Tourist. Damn tourist. Can't your dogfish sniff out the thief? Old soggy sniffer ain't what it used to be. Oh no. But if he can get the three golden pipes, he can pick up the scent. We'll find the three golden pipes, Uncle Blanny. You're my only hope, nephew. You and your friend, Freddy Fish. Yeah, so they changed the antagonist. Which uh, I, I feel is kind of for the better, really. It'd probably be stale if it were the same antagonist every time. I remember these guys from the previous games. Yeah, you do. Anyways, we can play with this.
Step right up, Gil, then buoy for the most amazing carnival under the sea. You remember the terrific tumble tooth ride last year? Well, what we've got in store for you this year is even better. Okay. I think orange. Wow, it's a grandma grouper fortune teller machine. I've heard about these. Is Grandma Grouper really that famous? Yeah, um, so I think, like, Orange Jesus has a pretty interesting campaign for us today. They brought a carnival organist okay, maybe for the not, Founder's not Day Festival. I love music. Yeah, so there's, like, you know, more possibilities, really. Let's right, so look at this. Wow. Awesome. <coughs> wow. Okay. I figure I might as well uh, see if my friend's interested in this stream. He might be coming anytime, who knows. He's a cool guy. He's probably cooler than me, I think. So uh, we'll see what Orange Jesus has for us this time. Look, Luther, a plastic shovel. We could use it to dig a hole all the way to the other side of the world. Whatever you say, Luther. <coughs> they don't say China, so we don't know if China is canon what in this What do game. you know about who stole the great conch shell? The last person I saw near it was Horst Fetters. Maybe he's the one who took it. Huh. Look, Freddy! It's a purple sea urchin! Thank God. Got it! There's songs there, but honestly, like, I don't really like songs in this game. Whoa! Yeah. Anyway, it's pretty easy puzzle to just do that. <laughs> Look, Luther! The doorway's clear! Swell! Yay! We got the doorway clear. And we can just go in. Okay, so... Freddy, it's the terrific tumble tubes! I won't fit in these tubes, Luther, but you can go. Okay, so it seems as if, like, yeah, Orange Jesus doesn't that. exactly have that need of a campaign for us. Um, this is also probably the shortest Freddy Fish game. I used to play this, like, multiple times, like, in one day as a kid. Until, like, it suddenly spat me at, like, a demo of their other games, and then I just stopped playing. <coughs> I remember one time, like, you know, I played this, like... I, I I played this like three times in a row and then like suddenly it like insisted that you had to play like a demo of Pajama Sam or something and I just like cl either closed the game or shut off the computer. I don't know. I, I'm not making that up. Yes, say you want world peace. Yes, say you want bulging pectoral fins and thin thighs. Well, tough nuggies, you won't get that here. <coughs> but for only four purple sea urchins, what you will get is a chance to prove your skill and have a thrill at Gil Barker's world-famous floating fun. It's the perfect game for a fish with a sharp eye and a steady fin. That sounds like you, Freddy. So she's not only cute, but she can also shoot. Well, let's have four purple sea urchins and you can show us your stuff. 
Oh, shoot. Oh, boy. My parents would have a field day with that. No. But who gives a shit? Oh, boy. Um, I think I know what uh, RNG Jesus has in store for us now. I have a feeling what he's up to. Oh. <coughs> the funny foreigner, guys. Excuse me, sir. May we please have that shim sham jimity jam clapper gapper in your bag? He's speaking a foreign language. I don't think he understood a word you said, Luther. May we please have the shim sham jimity jam clapper gapper in your bag? Luther, if he doesn't know our language, speaking slower and louder won't make him understand you any better. Have you seen the great conch shell? You're ready to see the ability to horse. Give me the word of it, there's a bit you could do about it. Why would anybody want to frame Uncle Blenny for stealing the great conch shell? Ready to come on, we're ready to see your claw. Ah, that makes sense. Yeah, that really makes sense, huh? Hmm. Wow. Hey, remember Fatty Bear? <coughs> All these other great, like, humongous entertainment game characters. Hip hop, hope. Remember, he said that in the game. Everyone loves multiple colors. Hey, another... Look, Freddy, it's a Snaboopy Pop. No, it's not. It's a purple sea urchin. I knew that. I just like to say Snaboopy Pop. Snaboopy Pop. Snaboopy Pop. Snaboopy Pop. You're not funny. I'm, I'm getting sick of Luther. Hey, look. There are loads of orange sea urchins in this wallet. We're rich, rich, rich. <coughs> this wallet doesn't belong <coughs> to us, Luther. Oh, shit. According to this identification card, it belongs to someone who used to be the grand exalted keeper of the conch. I'll oh, hold on okay. to it until we can find the owner. Is he even supposed to have money? Well, let's go in there. Yeah, Aaron Jesus is not giving us an interesting campaign this time. Hey, get out of the bullies club. Oh, you guys got the perfect dimensions for a punching bag. Now stop bugging me, or I'll take out my pen of frustrations on ya. This guy just doesn't know how to be a polite host. Well, it's a bully's club, you dumbass. <coughs> Look at that shading, and how, like, there's different colors and everything. This is a nice 8-bit, 256 colors. At their best. Hey, better, better, better. Wow. Lots of random shit. Yeah, Orange Jesus is not giving us any, like, interesting things this time. I don't know what the hell Orange Jesus has in store for us. Actually, now that I think about it, I think... Wow. Actually, now I think, like, Orange Jesus has, like, some plan for us. Um... In 
alright plan. So let's see, um... Oh, now it makes sense, Orin Jesus. Hey, Luther! Do you <coughs> see what I see? Okay, maybe, maybe that was, yeah, let's, hang on, let's go there, maybe that was probably better. Monkey. Mammals are cannon. Are you okay? I'd be better if my boat hadn't sprung a leak. Actually, mammals were. I had were... to strike my sail yeah. and use it to plug the hole. Without a sail to catch the wind, I'm stuck out here. <laughs> <sighs> that island has beautiful looking banana trees. I wish I could get over there. Hmm. Perhaps we have something to stuff in the hole so you could hoist your sail. <coughs> that would be stupendous. Then I could get moving again. Okay, um... I didn't really bring it up, but did you see that, uh, airplane down there? Again, that's like another kind of, like, unexplained lore piece of Freddy Fish that My we'll never know. My leaking boat. Don't worry, Magenta. We'll have your problem solved in a snap. <coughs> okay, Luther. Let her rip. Uh, poor choice of words there, Freddy. Good news! The hole's plugged! Uh, the bad news is I ripped your sail badly. Oh, no, shit. it looks like you ripped it quite well. Don't worry, Magenta. We'll get your sail fixed. We promise. Something happened with the with Windows for a second. Everything just blinked. You know how Windows is. It just does that. Hey! Look, a purple sea urchin. Freddy, how come there are no pink polka dotted sea urchins? But there are. They live in the secret sea. Where everything is pink and polka dotted. Oh, this is canon. Lore. You just made that up, didn't you? Uh huh. Oh. Well, uh. Whatever. Hey, Luther. Help me dig <coughs> out this old hollow log and pull it into the water. Okie dokie. Started casually. Help me push this log. Well, I'm not pushy by nature, but in this case, I'll make an exception. <sighs> if we can just keep the log moving, we'll be home free. Okay, first let's do this. Look, Freddy, there's something behind that waterfall. Wait! People will yell at me if I don't do this. Those are your shit. Whew. That knocked the wind out of me. Me too. We're just gonna have to find another Please. way to get to that waterfall. But you're a fish. Let's not ask about... Let's not ask questions. Let's just, just push. A little further and we'll have this log in position. Let's really help us. <coughs> I just had a brainstorm. This old hollow log might help us get through the waterfall. You should try having brainstorms on a more regular basis. 
Exactly. Be smart, Luther. Okay, now I'm not sure what the hell Iron Jesus has in store for us. We have a pop filter. Uh, let's get out of here. And go down. Oh man, twenty seven seconds already. At uh, twenty seven minutes already. What? What the hell am I on? Well... Okay. Oh. We found this wallet. There's your wallet, bitch. My wallet! You're both doing such a good job helping me. Please, take an orange sea urchin for your trouble. Thanks a lot! Just one? Luther, say thank you. Thank yeah, you, good. Uncle Blenny. Good job, Luther. Well, I know what the hell I'm spending this on. I don't know. But... Alright. How would you thing. like to sell that foreign language <coughs> phrase book for one orange sea urchin, Sam? I'd rather get a snack, but an orange sea urchin will do. Hey, I'll buy all the snacks with the orange sea urchin. Thanks a lot, Sam. We'll put this to good use. Hey, a book. Whoa. a book. What? I don't know about you, but I just love the graphics. I always kind of love the graphics of this series. <coughs> I don't know, I just love the visual style of Freddy Fish. I am us. Pierre Latella. Monsieur Pierre, do you think you can mend our sail for us? Oui, oui. Now observe, mere mortals, as the great Pierre creates from the tattered rag so the like nautical fashion step. <coughs> <coughs> Voila! C'est fini! Fini! Well, he said to say it. Sheesh! So we know, like, the whereabouts of two of the pipes. We basically got the solution. Maybe I didn't check. Maybe there was, uh... Maybe there was one here. Maybe I didn't see it. You know, just, like, weird-ass blindness. Oh! Look, look. 
It's one of the golden I didn't pipes. notice this. Oops. Yeah, but how are we going to get it out? We'll just need to find something small enough to fit in that tube. Well, here's the logic puzzle. Aren't Jesus really wanted us to do something interesting? And here it is. I think it's like trial and error or something. No, it isn't. There we go. And we got it. Aaron Jesus it's had a good plan for us pipes. all along. Good job, Luca. Now we need just two more golden pipes for old Dolly to pick up the scent. <coughs> Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Nobody knows my sorrow. Gee. I wonder how many golden pipes Freddy and Luther have now. I One. sure hope you're right. Oh. What did the dog say to him? He said rough, bitch. Life really is rough. Okay, so, yeah. Here's the plan. Freddy, I can't understand a word that foreign tourist is saying. What? Maybe we can find the language he's speaking he said in this foreign language phrase book. <clears throat> okay, first we have to open it. May we please have the Shim Sham Jiminy Jam Clapper Gapper that's in your bag? I guess that wasn't his language. Oh crap, I guess we're screwed. Or, well, do this. Oh hey, I think that's it. May we please have the Shim Sham Jiminy Jam Clapper Gapper that's in your bag? We did it. Brother Kumasint here from the So, the Shim Sham Jiminy Jam Clapper Gapper that's been giving Horst Feather so much trouble is what you want? I'd be glad to give you to it. What? Oh, that's so funny. What? Thank you, Mr. Feather, sir. It's a Shim Sham Jiminy Jam. How long will you be in town? Okay. My eyebrows to the store take. Hmm, that phrase book isn't 100% accurate, is it? Have you seen any golden pipes around here? You gotta talk to this dude. Blankets, He's the best blankets, character. Blankets. That phrase book leaves something to be desired. Have you seen the great conch shell? Of course, see not the great shell conch. I've oh. been at the volcano look. Oh, hey. That made sense. How's your vacation going? No business like show business there is. I predict that phrase book is going to make this a very interesting trip for our friend. Why yeah. did you steal the great conch shell? Yeah, why? Tell us, jam foreigner. It was me no not why I come here. The festival of founders was. Where can I get a shirt like yours? Yeah, exactly. I want it. The simply delicious meatballs were. I don't think the people who wrote that phrase book speak our language either. You're not dressed like other folks around here. Where are you from? The bridge through sky fly. I suspect our friend doesn't quite have the hang of using that phrase book. Do you know a good place to eat around here? 
Yeah. My poodle, excellent cat mileage gets. Whew! At least we're lucky the book worked once. Wow. Oh, who would steal the great conch shell? The Barker guild to himself all the customers he wants. Maybe the great conch shell he stole. Thank you for giving us the Shim Sham Jimmy Jam Clapper Gapper, sir. Okay. They're like nothing is hairy dogfish. The book may not be so useful for foreign phrases, but it sure is good for a laugh. Exactly, Luther. Oh, Are you in town for the festival? <coughs> My purple tie, too tight is. Oh. Hmm, that phrase that. book isn't 100% accurate, is it? Uh, well, enough, like, fooling around. Let's get to the mission at hand. It would be nice to talk to him all day. But, um... Hmm. I have to get a pipe. Hey, Magenta. We've brought you something you really wanted. A banana split? No, it's a sale for your vote. Good as new. Yay. Such beautiful banana trees. Thanks for your help. It's a shim sham jimmy jam clipper capper. Magenta. All we need is one more golden pipe, and old Soggy can sniff out the thief. Hey, Aaron, Jesus. Uh, is it true that we're not going to have a festival? Is it, Mommy? Gee, I hope they can find that conch shell so we can have That's a, girl. a festival. That's I've a woman? waited all year. Uh. Yeah, it looks. Or she looks pretty fancy. Uh, well, anyways. Let's. Let's go here! Oh god! Oh. I'm tired, it's like midnight. Ugh. A shim sham jimmy jam clapper gather will keep that clam from snapping shut. Okay, Luther, I'm gonna need your help. Righto, Freddy! <laughs> yeah. Yikes! I got a golden pipe! I don't care what anyone else says, you're a good fish. We did it, Freddy! It's nice that they care we about each other. all three golden pipes! Come on! Let's see if old Soggy can pick up the bad guy's scent. 
Here you go, boy. All right. Well, Come on, Luther. Here, here We've comes got a bad game. guy to catch. By the way, here's some ruins. What it's doing underwater, I don't know. Old doggy. Looks like people the ruins. by mac acid reflux a jewel i'm going to be rich 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 luther Ugh. oh he got fucked by his uh -oh. character flaw <coughs> hey oh, what luther. happened well i i saw this jewel and, and then i took it out and the door closed and i don't just put the jewel back luther yeah luther <laughs> After I said something, after Don't she worry. said something I'll good about you, I'll find a way too. to get you out so you can put the jewel back, and we can catch that thief. <laughs> Old Soggy, you go on ahead and track that shell thief. We'll meet you back at the center of town as soon as we can. <laughs> Anyways, it's probably the very simple, probably one of the simplest hey, puzzles I'll ever. Hey, I'll bet that's the key I need <laughs> to get Luther out. Just, just wait for this. Whoa. Nothing in this place is as easy as it looks. Of course. The solution to this is very simple. Very simple. Let's get to the solution. Greeny? Huh? First things first, let's draw some stuff. Uh, it's a chisel! I should hold on to this. It might come in handy. Another, oh no, stream health is... Okay, stream health is fine. I'm sorry. It's a chisel. Sorry, I get so paranoid. I know there's like some part here for some reason, like this late in the game. At like, basically end game, basically. A chisel like you could draw. loosen that crystal. This might set off another <coughs> trap. But I've got to try everything to get Luther out. Ah. This nice. crystal sure gives off a lot of green light. That might come in very handy. Hey, the crystal grew back. Uh, we've seen these animations. Uh, ooh. Where? Uh, where? Where is the drawing part? Was Was it just a Mandela effect thing? Where like? Yeah, there was a drawing effect in my childhood, but uh-oh, it's not there anymore. Yeah, I guess it was a Mandela effect or something. I don't know. I have <coughs> an idea. chisel on that statue. I might damage it. If we're going to save the Founder's Day... Okay. Well, I 
like it. Let's get Luther. Alright, Luther, you little shit. That's what you're supposed to... Yeah, we're supposed to click that. <coughs> yes! Luther! I'm free! Hey. Let's put that jewel back. Put it back, you little shit. There we go. Look, Lothar, the thief must have dropped this bag. <gasps> Looks like we can solve this case. Come on. I hear came two for this. Disappointed my old silver-haired granny will be if not <coughs> snapshot I bring back from festival. It's unbelievable! The letdown of a lifetime! This is more disappointing than when the Plankton Circus came to town! It's all Uncle Flinny's fault! I'm gonna give that bomb a piece of my mind! Please kill me! Did, did Uncle someone Flinny just say please innocent. kill me? <gasps> the thief dropped this bag. When we looked inside, we found a claw-shaped boxing glove, which means the thief is... Well, it's obviously Wait the horn. Wait a minute. Huh? Could the thief possibly be horse? No, because he's a bit Not was me. Gee, if it wasn't horse, then who's the thief? It's him. Wait he's a lying. Minute. Could the thief possibly be horse? No, no. Brave and kill sir. Brave and never. Not was me. Gee, if it wasn't horse, then who's the thief? It was him. Wait a minute. Could he's the lying. Thief possibly be horse? No, no, pretty but kill sir, brave and never. Not was me. Gee, if it wasn't horse, then who's the thief? Well, I mean, he's immortal, Wait so a he's doing. Could the thief possibly be Pierre the Tailor? I am Pierre the Tailor. Pierre the genius. Not Pierre the common crook, you silly little green fish. Gee, if it wasn't Pierre, then who's the thief? This weird ass, uh. It's a weird ass Wait a minute, could us. the thief possibly be Rosie Pearl? I got a watertight alibi. I was on stage when the crime was committed, and every fish in the audience will vouch for me. Gee, if it wasn't Rosie, then who's the thief? It's this Wait guy. a minute, could the thief possibly be Nadine the Narwhal? Girl. A thief? What an utterly preposterous idea. Why, if you weren't so little and green and cute, I, I'd never speak to you again. Gee, if it oh wasn't Nadine, then who's the thief? Well, I mean, obviously Wait a it's minute. this shady character. Could the character. thief possibly be Gil Barker? No, I'm afraid you're barking up the wrong tree, half pint. Now get a move on, get out of the way before you ruin my whole business day. Gee, if it wasn't Gil, then who's the thief? Okay, it's a root. You're the thief. Oh, that could have been anybody's claw shaped boxing glove <laughs> in that bag. You ain't got nothing on me. Ouch! Oh, oh no? Ouch. <laughs> okay, okay. So maybe you do have something on me. I confess. The guys at the police club made me do it. They're even bigger bullies than I am. Claw, you can't blame voice, someone else the for the things that you do wrong. You voice should know that no matter what anyone else says, <laughs> it's just plain wrong to steal. I've been a selfish shellfish. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. sorry. He's the great conch. Uncle Blenny, we're sorry we blamed you. That's okay. I'm still the grand, exalted keeper of the conch. Thanks to Freddy and Luther. <laughs> oh, and old Chucky. Gosh, what can I don't, ever don't do to thank me. you? Just do your duty, old grand exalted keeper of the conch. Claw was convicted of violating Penal Code 119 for having a really bad attitude. As punishment, he was sentenced to take remedial classes in ballet for bullies and has to wear a tutu and little pink dance slippers to school for a whole year. Oh, Case closed. Um. 
Yeah. Um. Wow. Yeah. That was the game. We could play again, but. I feel tired. Okay. I feel a bit tired. Ta-da! the end maybe someone will come in and say hello or something i don't know because that usually tends to happen whenever people stop streaming well that's it well, i guess all we have to do is freddy fish 4 and then we did the entire series freddy fish 4 is probably my favorite one Freddy Fish 3 I have mixed opinions about, but it's pretty good. Pretty good. Though a bit short. And Orange Jesus can, can like, kind of deal you, like, an uninteresting game. But I mean, otherwise, I mean, that's my review. It's a good game. Let's, uh, let's stop streaming. Okay. I'm gonna stop streaming. I'm gonna press the clicker. I'm...